Hey guys, what's up Aquarius? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you, so flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading, so just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. I'm kind of spaced out on those cards. Maybe that's why somebody's been like uh, really conflicted mentally about how to move forward, maybe how to communicate. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. But it looks like somebody, I've seen the Magician and the Emperor. So maybe somebody's taking charge. Alright. Immediate for is fine. Whichever. Immediate future for, oh yeah. Oh my. Okay, wow. Straight to it. You got the Page of Swords, the Seven of Swords, the Three of Swords. Uh, somehow, um, for whoever this is, there's a third party situation. Or like an ex or something like that. I don't know how, how we'll see how it's going to play out. Because there's definitely probably some underlying things in Night of Wands. Somebody, you know, could have like ghosted a situation. It depends which way this like, what side of the storm, but somebody could have been, like, in and out, uh, maybe not committal, somebody could have ghosted a situation, this could also be, like, a marriage that fell, but there was something that came in between this, right, so now somebody is fine, and then you may have a third, third party situation, show me this page of swords, thank you, the queen of swords, that's your energy, I think you're very protective of your heart. Um, I mean, this could be you sneaking, or this is the Six of Swords. Um, or, you know, you're very protective of your heart. You may be, like, checking out, like, um, checking up on somebody, or vice versa. But the Six of Swords, you could be traveling. You could be, oh, no, no, no. You could be moving. Somehow there could be a Cancer Scorpio Pisces in the mix. Um, if you are traveling or moving, there could be some type of delays on uh, travel plans, setbacks. But something here has got you stressed the fuck out. So like I said, it depends. Um, this could be like, I mean, you could be sneaking or you could have suspicion. So you're doing some uh, spying. Some checking up the star, yeah, that's your energy too. Somebody may have like walked away from something, said no thank you, or like just really nervous. I don't want to say no thank you. Like these kind of cards. Show me the seven of swords. So seven of swords is Aquarius energy. You got the six of swords, the seven of swords. So it's like the page of pentacles. It's like trying to pull away from something. That's stressing you out, but I think it's stressing you out even more. Tell me about, tell me more about, okay, thanks. Tell me more about the Seven of Swords. Could be done with a younger air sign. Doesn't have to be, I don't want that many. They all just want to fly out. Something here has been got yeah, the Queen of Pentacles. Uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy for some. There could be like a mother-child situation. Uh, the King of Cups and the Two of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy again. It looks like if this is like a situation where like there is like a child involved or, um, you know, something like that. I can definitely see that. But on one side, somebody's kind of just letting go, like doing a whole lot of healing over here. So sometimes this King of Cups energy can be like, um, can be on a good day, being in love with your best friend, that type of thing. Like a lot of love, a lot of sensitivity, but also this can be somebody who, you know, um, 
can be a manipulator of energy. Like, I get him where you fit in on their schedule. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Drop the card. I'm trying to see. Let's see the outcome. Because, um, it's like on one side something's shaking. On another side, it's kind of like letting go. Show me this Three of Swords for Aquarius for the outcome. Looks like somebody, you know, even if it's not like a, a child, mother, child situation, um, it, it could just be you really focused on like house, home, maybe you're writing a book in some situations. Um, that's not a very argumentative energy. That's a very stable energy. All right. Show me this, uh, outcome. It looks like on one side. And I don't know which way it's going. Somebody's not trying to lose something. Like, to let go of it. It means a lot. So, with the Ace of Cups, there's something new that's kind of kick-starting there. Because somebody doesn't... You may have a player coming back around. Or, I mean, just somebody who is a player. Because that Knight of Wands is... Um... Like I said, definitely non-committal. It depends what side of this you're on, Aquarius. You're going to have to fit this. Fit this in like, like it resonates. And if it's not your reading, don't take it. The King of Wands. For some, there could have been a married man. Um, but that's, that is a type, you know, that's somebody with a lot of confidence, a lot of swag, uh, a lot of people drawn to that type of energy. So it kind of feels like, um, like I said, depending on what side you're on, this person could be returning, yeah, the judgment for like a reconciliation, trying to start something new, but it's kind of fast energy, yeah, things are still divided here. Alright, Aquarius. Just, you're going to kind of flip this one to how it fits in with your story. It definitely looks like, you know, there's another piece to a puzzle. Um, but on, on one side, it's, it's, you're doing a lot of healing here. A lot of, like, actually finding peace. Maybe focusing on work. But again, you got to... Plug it into how it fits your story. Alright, Aquarius. I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information below as well. You guys take care and I will see you next time. Bye.